Hey creators, C Bullock here, and today we'll be looking at transitions in Movavi Video Editor Plus 2020 or 2021. First, you'll want to go ahead and drag any tracks down to your main video track here, and you can use transitions on photos or videos. Today I'm going to be working with videos, so I'm going to go to the transitions tab over here and then select one of these. It's as simple as dragging your transition down to the cut between clips and over it. Now you can apply it to just one side of the clip and that will look like this here or you can apply it to both videos. So then there's your transition. Now you can go in and edit the transition by double clicking that and then I can change the length of the transition and I can change what it shows and that in the transition or as it transitions. You can show trimmed content which will be the video that you've trimmed off and if you don't have enough trimmed content it will go to a freeze frame. You can choose to have it go to a freeze frame. So if I want the video to pause as it transitions I'll choose freeze frame. Or I can choose slow motion which can work if you don't have much video but you want to keep it moving during the transition you don't want it to have that pause then you might choose slow motion. So for today, I'm going to be using trim content, which is what I usually use on transitions. Now in here, you can also choose to apply this to all transitions. So if I have multiple transitions on the track, I can click this and it will apply these settings to every transition. You can also adjust the link here. So when I hover over this, it will allow me to adjust it visually instead of having to click in and actually change the time. To remove the transition, I can click, use the right click to remove transition, and you can also choose to remove all transitions from this point. You can also remove it by clicking this X here, and that will take it away. Now if I want to apply transitions to multiple tracks quickly, then I can go into the transition wizard by clicking this button right here and then I can choose random transitions or specific transitions to apply to the entire project. We're going to go to those fade transitions because that's included with the basic Movavi video editor. Now I can choose multiple fades so that it will rotate through different ones if I want something different or I can just sing choose a single fade if I want it to do the same transition every time. So we'll choose a few here and then we're going to apply to all clips and you see it added the transition to every clip including the ending now if you're using photos, you can change the duration dur you can change the photo clip duration, but if I have video clips and I try to apply the link to all clips, it does not change them. But if these are photos, this would work to make your clips the exact same length. Same thing for this here, the pan and zoom does not work with video. It only works if you're using if you're doing a photo thing here. You would have to go in and pan and zoom through this tab instead. Now to get a little deeper into some of the transitions, if you want to apply an ending or an opening to your video, like a transition into the video, it will transition in from black like that or transition out to black and then you just have this half transition. Now in the Video Editor 2021, the, one of the new big changes is the fact that you can add transitions to overlays. So let's say I have this as an overlay. Previously, I could not have a transition on that clip. But now you're able to drag transitions to the overlay so that the overlay can come in with, a different, with different transition options instead of just having to animate it. Now, if you want more transitions to work with, you can get additional transitions for Movavi Video Editor Plus through their effects store. The different effects packs include a few transitions. You just have to check each effect pack to see what they include. Or if you really want to go for it, you can get their unlimited subscription, which is what I have. And it gives you access to a ton of different transitions and things you can use. Some of these transitions that come with the packs are really cool. They've got some scary ones, these happy splashes. I really like some of those. There's these with the new good game pack, which is like great for countdowns. This glamorous Moscow pack has glitter transitions. Should be great if you're doing like makeup videos or something. Then there's the digital system. I think this is great for gaming. There's the basics of Movavi transitions. 
you can end up using them for a lot of different things. I use them on overlays sometimes for logo effects or for different opening videos or ending videos. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe and we'll see you next time.